हेलो एवरीबडी वेलकम टू मैथमाफिया टूडे वी विल प्रूव डिविजन ट्रांजिटिविटी थ्योरम दिस थ्योरम स्टेट्स दैट इफ ए डिवाइड्स बी एंड बी डिवाइड सी देन ए आल्सो डिवाइड्स सी वेयर ए बी एंड सी आर इंटीजर्स एंड ए एंड बी आर आल्सो नॉट इक्वल टू जीरो सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द प्रूफ वी आर गिवन दैट ए डिवाइड्स बी What does this mean? This means that a completely divides b. This also means that a is a divisor of b, or we can say that b is a multiple of a. So this can be written as b is equal to a times some integer k one, where k one is any integer. To understand this a little more, let's consider an example. when we say that 12 divides 24 which means 24 can be written as 12 into some integer which in this case is 2 so that's why we have written b is equal to a into k1 for some integer k1 now we are also given that b divides c so let's write it here b divides c this would mean that c can be written as c is equal to b times some integer say k2 so k2 also belongs to the set of integers now let's do one thing let's call this as equation number 1 and this as equation number 2 and we have to prove that a divide c let's do one thing we will put the value of b from equation number 1 into equation number 2 so let's do that so c becomes The value of b was a times k1 into k2. Now k1 and k2 were integers, so k1 into k2 would also be an integer. Let's call that k3. So now we have written c as product of a with another integer. So from here we can conclude that a divides c. hence proved just in case you are still wondering why we have written a divide c because just now we have proved that c is a multiple of a so that's why we can write that a divide c so i hope you have now understood the division transitivity theorem and its proof that's it for this video keep watching mathemafia